I cannot give initiation to the whole world because I don't know who wants it. And it's, it's impossible. Only they have to go into a place together. And I either do it myself, give the initiation, or through the representative, I empower that person to do the initiation on my behalf. Only for that time. In God's grace, God's blessing. Right, yes. The people have to be vegan and vow to be vegan for life. Otherwise, if they are not vegan and they sneak in just to spy, or it's just curiosity without any repentance in their heart, without respect for God's grace and benevolence. So if I give them initiation without them being vegan, then they will be punished even more than if they didn't know. Wow. Because it's just like you know the law and you don't abide by the law. If you don't know, then maybe you have some excuse. Yes, Master, that's right. And the law in every country is also different already, and not everybody knows all the laws. But the law of the universe, you know or not know, is still measure out the punishment for you. Yeah, yes. Because they judge that your soul knows everything, because the soul does know everything. Mm. It's just that the mind doesn't listen and tells the brain, tells the body to do bad things. Mm -hmm. That is a problem. The mind is also being influenced by others around it and that just lashes out or dishes out whatever he thinks he has collected all that time, good or bad. Yes. The mind and the brain cannot judge very well and don't listen to the soul. The soul tries so hard to work through the mind and says, no, not that one, this one. But the mind doesn't always listen because humans are too busy. The minds are busy, anything else except them. So God, virtues and benevolence. Yes, Master. The problem is the mind and the brain. And I cry my heart out all the time. Sometimes, excuse me, I also been very rude to God. I say, we don't know anything. We humans, we are ignorant. We don't know so much. We can't see anything. We don't know the consequences. We don't know what's truly good, what's truly bad. And we're too busy being forced to work day or night, half of the day, half of the night already. Yes. We come home very tired or even work at home also tired, exhausted. My body and thoughts, so you can't even think too well. You can't just keep punishing humans like that. You have to do something, you have to... <laughs> and God told me, I send my son, I send masters, I send teachers, I send saints and sages all over, everywhere all the time, in every period of your earth, to teach you. You guys just don't want to listen. Wow. Mm. And so I could not say much more, but I said, please, please, I cannot bear all this. Please do something. Oh. <laughs> please help humans to understand. <laughs> please help the animal people, so no more suffering. And God didn't say anything, heaven didn't say anything quite, so I said, please, even if they have to die horribly, please rescue their souls or let me do it. Oh. It's all on me then. Oh. Just put it all on me. It's possible like that. They didn't say anything. Oh. And then I got out of my conference with them. I got out and I couldn't get in anymore. They didn't talk to me anymore. Uh -huh. And I keep screaming, yelling, pacing in and out, up and down, around the place. Oh, master. Yeah. I say, you must listen to me. You can't pretend you don't know. You can't pretend you don't hear me. You must, must do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but then that's that. That's 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 okay.